in the Congress in September, we will have a major emphasis on the water and climate agenda. What do you actually need to do to adapt water management more rapidly maybe than we had thought? And how can water management and the energy that goes around it that become more efficient and in that sense contribute to mitigating carbon emissions. It's about 5 to 10 percent of the world's carbon emissions come from the water industry. And so there's quite a bit of opportunity to actually work on this agenda. Another challenge that we have seen around the world is with the increasing demands for food, for energy, for cities, for industries, well there's only a limited amount of water that is available uh, in terms of fresh water. So we need to become much smarter about how we coordinate between giving different sectors that are vital for economies the amount of water and the right kind of quality that they need. And so in the Congress we will be having bring together the experts that actually are at the forefront of optimizing between the energy sector, the industry sector, the urban sector and the agriculture sector. And it's a huge challenge. We bring together about more than 5,000 top water professionals from around the world that are at the forefront of new solutions to water challenges. We bring together, as Jaime was pointing out, the regulators, the utilities, the technology providers, the consultants, the scientists, the researchers, and also the NGOs that are all working, sometimes together, sometimes not so together, on trying to address the water challenges. So it's a very solutions-oriented crowd that will be gathering here in Lisbon taking into account very much the problems that we face, but they all come here with a bit of a, a can-do attitude. So the stories that will be emerging over the coming weeks, running up to the Congress, will be the stories of, yes, there are some major problems in the world, and we'll come back to some of those, but there also there are a lot of opportunities and possibilities to really put our shoulders on and actually addressing them.